My name is Mathilde, I'm a communication officer and coordinator of the EWWR at ADEM, the French Agency for Ecological Transition. In the perspective of accompanying changes in citizen behavior, we participate in EWWR and we mobilize all actors on the national territory to organize actions in favor of waste reduction. This in certain times have shown us the importance of human contact, cooperation between individuals and the strengths of the collective. Uh, the EWWR is a committed to promoting a circular social and solidarity economy that is closer to local issues. Ciao. 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 We are Deborah, Ivana, and Francesco, and we represent ICA, International Association for Environmental Communication in Italy. We are in the steering committee because we want to be part of the change makers in the European scenario. And we believe that the EWWR is one of the biggest initiatives that can help Europe to promote sustainable consumption and production. Of course, the topic of circular communities is fundamental within the promotion of waste prevention because it's only together that we can make the difference and we can create collective sustainable solutions. An economic system that works is about taking care of people. For achieving a circular economy, we need to reconnect as human beings and put together our energies for a greener post-pandemic world. Hi everyone, I'm Sarah Lizai, project officer at ACR Plus, the Association of Cities and Regions for Sustainable Resource Management, and I'm also in charge of the European coordination of the European Week for Waste Reduction. Um, ACR Plus has been part of this initiative since the very beginning, from 2009, when the, the campaign was born under the LIFE program. And uh, in ACR Plus, every day we try to support cities and regions to move towards this uh, circular economy. And we strongly believe that this needed ecolog ecological transition um, needs to be pushed also by a social change. And this is what the EWWR campaign is doing. Small and local communities can play a key role to move towards a less waste world and the EWWR can gather all together these innovative, creative and powerful actions in one week. And actually, being together, we are stronger. Hi, my name is Mireia Padros. I am working at the Catalan Waste Agency. We take part at the European Week for Waste Reduction since 2009. We know that being part of this huge network is the best way to promote waste prevention across Europe and to turn the concept of waste reduction into reality. This project aims to motivate people to take action, to demonstrate that our consumption and production have a real impact on climate change and to highlight the link between waste reduction and sustainable development. Our slogan is the best waste is the one that is not produced. Thanks a lot. My name is Ariane Godou. I work for the Regional Administration for the Environment in Brussels, more specifically in the Waste and Resource Department. We take part in the European Week for Waste Reduction for three reasons. First of all, because we believe that it's important to repeat that the best way to manage waste is still to avoid waste. Secondly, because within our organization, a lot of our colleagues are focused on other themes such as biodiversity, food, water, air pollution or energy and it's always good once a year to say hey don't forget waste prevention and finally because as public administration we must be exemplary we have to say what we do and to do what we say my name is Kisser Stelpstra and I am a member of the European Committee of the Regions 
the body that represents European local and regional communities bringing their forces at the European Union level. As Rapporteur of the Committee of the Regions for the new Circular Economy Action Plan, I've worked on waste policy and I've seen how important this sector is for local and regional authorities that in most countries have significant roles in particular on waste collection and management. Furthermore, local representatives experience directly the problems caused by an inefficient waste policy. For these reasons, I'm happy that the Committee of the Regions is part of the Steering Committee of the European Week for Waste Reduction and supports its activities. I was also glad to be in the jury for the annual awards that allow to recognize the best actions organized during the Week for Waste Reduction and disseminate good ideas at European level. The theme of this year, Circular Community, is particularly interesting. Circularity needs to be implemented at local level. Certain challenges and certain solutions are specific of small communities, even below the municipal level, such as urban neighborhoods, rural villages, mountain habits, small islands and others. We need to approach waste reduction and waste prevention with an eye to the specificities of the many different EU communities and work together for a more resilient, more circular Europe. Hi everyone, my name is Declan Breen and I represent the Eastern Midlands Regional Waste Management Office in Ireland. As an island we can tend to feel a little disconnected from the rest of Europe and the European Week for Waste Reduction is a great way to help us feel involved and to be part of something much bigger. This year's theme of circular communities helps to strengthen that connection. And while individual actions are great, in order for us to enact real change, we need to do it together. Hi, I'm Rita Rebelo and I'm part of Lipor Prevention Working Group. Lipor is the waste management company of Greater Porto in Portugal. We are part of the steering committee because we believe that prevention is the best way to fight waste production. Circular communities are essential to waste prevention since they promote sharing, reusing, refusing, recycling, as well as solidarity. Hello, my name is Luba Günther. I'm coordinator of European Week for Waste Reduction in Germany. It's coordinated by the Association of Municipal Enterprises. Participation in the steering committee is important for a big European exchange. The topic of this year is circular communities. And circular communities stimulate other groups to reduce waste, to protect the environment in favor of social, economical and ecological resilience. Hi, I'm Luana from Malta and I represent WasteServe. WasteServe is the only company in Malta responsible for organizing, managing and operating integrated systems for waste management. WasteServe is also the EWWR coordinator for Malta and Gozo. Waste management and more importantly waste generation is a matter of global concern. As we become more aware of the detrimental effects of poor waste management, it becomes increasingly more evident and compelling that serious action needs to be taken not only by the EWWR steering committee but also by the general public. First of all, the importance of EWWR is that it brings together thoughts and ideas from all over Europe. This in itself gives one a sense of community. Second, circular economy is a phrase we are hearing a lot nowadays, be it on the news, on the radio and so on. What is it and how do we go about it? Although some might know its actual meaning, there are others who might be less knowledgeable. Therefore, more awareness needs to be raised to steer the country away from the linear industrial model and move on to a more sustainable approach. Together we can make it happen.